The presidential broadcast is an integral part of the Independence Day celebration in Nigeria. And as Nigerians mark the 64th independence anniversary, President Bola Tinubu addresses the nation. Fellow Nigerians. First, President Tinubu acknowledges the economic hardship experienced by citizens, such as the rising cost of living, unemployment and insecurity challenges. He promised to address them soon. As I address it today, I am deeply aware of the struggles many of you face in these challenging times. Our administration knows that many of you struggle with rising costs and the search for meaningful employment. My fellow Nigerians, please be assured that we are implementing many measures to reduce the cost of living uh, at home. Aside from the issues of economic hardship, we President Tunubu announces plans for a national youth conference aimed at discussing issues affecting young Nigerians and addressing them. We lead today with the future we wish to bequeath to our children in focus. Recognizing that we cannot design a future that belongs to them without making them its architects. Considering this, I am pleased to announce the gathering of a national youth conference. This conference will be a platform to address the diverse challenges and opportunities confronting our young people. The government will thoroughly consider and implement the recommendations and outcomes from this forum as we remain resolute in our mission to build a more inclusive, prosperous, and united Nigeria. Some of the issues that President Tunubu promised to discuss at the National Youth Conference include education, social justice, employment, innovation, and security. Speaking to matters related to political reforms, President Tunubu insists on the implementation of the Supreme Court's judgment on local government autonomy. As part of our efforts to re-engineer our political economy, we are resolutely in our determination to implement the Supreme Court judgment on the financial autonomy of local government. The president further highlighted the progress made in the fight against insecurity, fiscal policies, divestment in the oil and gas sector, as well as government's responses to natural disasters, such as the recent flooding in some parts of the country. <laughs> As Nigerians across the country mark the 64th Independence Day anniversary, the coming days are expected to unveil the impact of the plans and initiatives of the government to address the nation's challenges.